Now we are off on our way to Steve's house to go pick up his iPod touch that broke. So Joseph, huh? the fix it man, is gonna try to yeah, repair I'm a, it. I'm gonna try to repair it because I'm a really good fix it guy. Like seriously, I can fix anything. I can fix your PlayStation, your Xbox, whatever. But I can't fix my own Xbox, right? That's why I got like three of them saved up at my house. And um, yeah, so. Steve, if you're watching this, don't be mad if I break your iPod more. So. <laughs> then after that, on our way to Grandma's house to go pick up some workout clothes. <laughs> With no gas that we have to go oh, get. Oh, wow. <laughs> yes, I forgot. <laughs> Might run out of gas. Hopefully not. You think we'll make it to Steve's? No. I think we'll make it. No. Right out to Steve's apple gas. No, we won't make it. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my oh God. yellow light. Good breaks. Yeah. Good breaks. Go him it. Oh my god. There's like a piece of like body in the road or something. <laughs> I don't know what that oh. is. Oh my god. I don't know what the heck that is. This seat is like so lean forward. What are you waving at? In the mirror? Oh, I was like, <laughs> who the hell is over there? Like, who are you talking to? <laughs> Don't talk to my woman. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we're on our way to Steve's. And um, yeah, like she was saying, hopefully I can fix his iPod. And yeah, and um, we had so much fun at Arnold's house. I'm pretty sure you saw that in the other videos. And yeah, Arnold and his brother, he's pretty cool. I learned a lot of stuff from his little brother about his like. 13 year old brother that knows about the Beatles and Jimi Hendrix and. The who, the who and like and all these the bands and like and I didn't even know Bloods that the animals Lights. sung this one that the animals sung this one song that I swear never talk right but um yeah that they sung a song and it was a badass song and I'm, that's we're really into like to 50s to about the 70s kind of music honestly we're not hippies but if we had to choose I would be a hippie guaranteed Peace, love, and rock and roll, baby. So what about you, babe? What would you be if you could choose? A country western singer. <laughs> yeah, I have my own little Taylor Swift right here. Go, babe. Uh-oh. What is this? I, um, that means stop, you jackass. You son of a guns! Oh, please don't turn this way. Oh. He's just like reading in the back. I know, right? As if it's not even an emergency. He's just like sitting there reading a novel or something. <laughs> <laughs> well, look at that um, truck. That is a nice truck. Uh, uh. Yeah, so. And it's really ugly outside. It's really ugly outside. I don't even like it out here. It's so ugly. It's like Freddie Jackson up there. Yeah, that's pretty damn ugly. <laughs> if you ask me. Hey, Jackson? Know. Freddie Jackson. I don't know who the hell Freddie Jackson is. I don't even know if that's like a real person, but I've always heard that. Freddie uh, Jackson? Yeah, Freddie Jackson. Like, you ugly like Freddie Jackson. Like, who the hell? And they're like, oh, you ugly like Freddie Jackson. <laughs> but then everybody's like, who the fuck is Freddie Jackson? Like, does anybody know what Jackson? I thought there was only five. I don't I don't know. I could be wrong. There probably is a Freddie. And everybody's like, are you a fucking idiot? So if there, is, know, if there is a Freddie Jackson somewhere. And, Which um, way are we going? Straight. Devil's Den. Devil's Den! Oh. Oh, yeah, there's this place by our house. It's like a really gross ditch. But if you have a monster truck, hell yeah, that's like the best place to be. But, um, oh, I ew. mean, if this like hurries That's gross. Up. Sorry. That was gross. Didn't mean for y'all to see that. But I'm um, <laughs> picking eye boogers out of my eye. It's so gross, right? <laughs> oh. 1.45 in the afternoon. <laughs> oh, I washed my face this morning, okay? If it looks greasy, I'm sorry. I'm a greasy, I'm a greasy boy. I'm a greasy boy. I'm a greasy boy. But yeah, it's called Devil's Den because a lot of fucked up shit has happened there. Like, throughout the days, people have gotten raped, got their heads squished in. Like, really, really messed up things that nobody in their right mind should ever, ever have to go through. So yeah, that's what it's called Devil's Den. And now they're trying to actually build stuff around it that I think that's not cool. Like, these apartments right here, I would never live here. I would never. Nope. Because they're the Devil's Den's apartments! And no. At night, it's like pitch black. You can't even see your vehicles outside. Yeah. It's so dark. Yeah, I just pay attention to driving. Yeah, I should have almost hit that mess. <laughs> Fuck that hoe. So, we're almost to Devil's Den, and we'll be able to show you guys. 
devil's den. Not if it's not den. closed, oh, it's not closed off because people are all driving over there. But there's always an idiot that when it's so flooded likes to it's drive. It's like a really like low oh, so dip thing. Hello. And um. And it's not saying not to go, so fuck down. <laughs> and it's usually blocked <laughs> off. Here, here's the road. This is the. Doesn't that just look did. creepy? This is right before you get to Ingram Mall. I'll say Ingram Park. Is that the name of it? It's Ingram, yeah, Ingram Park. Ingram Park yeah. Is it Ingram Park Mall? Ingram Park. Park. See, there's all the Diablos! So... Yeah... It's kinda creepy. You'll see deer though. See? They say that some cobalt people live back there and they like kill people. How, oh, you can't really see it on the camera, but... Yeah. Maybe when we come back, we can like... Oh wait, we'll come back to Fort Turner, right? That was a policeman. Was it? Yes, it was lovely. Joe's Volcano. Oh, yeah. That's my volcano. It's just a DC Joe. That's his volcano. Yeah, so. That's Devil's Den for you. And um, if you've ever been there, that'd be cool. Say something about it, you know. And another thing we like to do, we like to go to the, um, like haunted places in San Antonio. And so far, we've went to the Minger Hotel downtown. We've went to Devil's Bridge yeah, in place. like by the San Jose Missions. Look at and up. yeah, Google it. San um, where else? The Donkey Lady Bridge that I only went on top of the bridge during the day. I know. I Screw been, that. I've been all along and through it all in the forest. It's scary. You won't even let me go by myself when I want to. Uh, okay, I'm gonna be all petrified, be not even be able to drive back home. I'll give you the keys. <laughs> I won't even be able to drive. <laughs> I'll be all petrified, like, what happened to him? Those boys are like, like 12 years old. Why the aren't they in school? Oh, so, and then another place we go to is the uh, railroad tracks where the kids, like, got hit oh, by a bus or no. something. Oh. It's a piece of wood or something. Oh my god, is it that fucking guy? This is terribly. <laughs> oh my god, I thought that dog was like splat, splat. Hey, there's pieces everywhere. So, this is a really long video so far. It is 7 minutes and 45 seconds. Yeah. Oh, look at them rams. Those are some oh, dogs. Oh, what? Zoom in. Zoom in. What? Oh, there, oh what? Oh. Wow, you got like the totally wrong. I thought you were talking about that. I was like, that's pretty cool. It's a Land Rover. So. Yeah, Devil's Bridge, the train tracks, the insane asylum, that is creepy. Even though that people say that it was never even an insane asylum, I know what I saw that one time I went and it was pretty scary. There's no way people can just lie and make up things like that. But um, that's about it. So if you guys have any places that y'all know about in San Antonio that are haunted and I haven't named them yet, let us know and we'll go. We, yeah, we we'll do stuff it. like that. Yeah, we will, we'll record you know it. What? We'll go to the train tracks and we'll record all of that. We'll it sucks that the flip doesn't have a light on it. So yeah. we can... Oh, but we bought a light. Yeah, we have a little flashlight. We can just use that for now. Right? Just, just, like, just so y'all can see it. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to do that. So if you guys have any other places in San Antonio that are haunted, or know of any places that are haunted that are, you know... Preferably, you know, not on private property because, you know, we don't want to go to jail while we do it. Yeah, because this is kind of like evidence that we're going on the property, so let's be smart about it, people. Okay? Let's be smart. Look so at let us. YouTube all in the video, all in my property. What does it say? Private property. Let us know if you guys have any other places, okay? Uh, you see my hat? Rate, comment, and subscribe. <laughs>